Welcome to John Alex on Anderson's TV. And me and Josh are going to talk about this British drum company. So it's quite a cool kit, isn't it? I like the finish. Finish is stunning. So all the Etimo, so this is an Etimo veneer on the outside. All the Etimo kits that British company will make are all individual. So the grain will be slightly different. Um, the light and dark will be in different places. So on the floor, Tom, there's like a stripe. It's really nice. So it is a beautiful finish. And it's mm -hmm. definitely check out the photos on our web listing because they are cool. It's, it's cool, isn't it, just to play something British. It's got the, the Union Jack and Made in Britain, but there's some pretty cool features, isn't it? Like the Tom mounts, you got on with those, didn't you? I do like these, because normally I always put it on a, my Tom on a snare stand, um, but it always gets choked, it doesn't resonate as it should do. So these, I've literally not seen them before. I had to ask what they're about, but they're great. So you get little um, ISO mounts, basically, so you get three of them, so when you put them on a snare stand, you're not getting, the drum isn't getting choked and held. So there's like, these are quite springy. So yeah, that's quite cool. Comes with it, so part of it. No, don't break it. I think that's my favorite feature actually. That tom sings then, because yeah. you said when I was mm -hmm. tuning it, wow, that, the rat tom sounds great. Not that the rest of the kit doesn't, but it. Well, the kick drum sounds wicked. I like it, it's punchy. I like shallow to um, kick drums, so. The shallow kick drums yeah. are back in fashion, so you've, you've your personal kit's quite a long one, isn't it? So it's it nice is. To... I wish I had one of these, though. A little, little so. shallower. Mm. Um, I quite like the really nice, like, chromed Palladium British Tram Company lugs. Not a big fan of full-length tension rods. I quite like two lugs on Tom's. So that's just my personal opinion. I like the actual, like, retro 50s-styled actual lug. I think that's cool. So this kit is limited edition. It's only going to come in 12, 16, 22, 14-inch snare. That is... You, you can't get add-ons, you can't do this, is literally just one-stop shop. It is a limited edition finish for the Lounge Series kit. Lounge is birch and mahogany, so the birch sings quite a bit, didn't it? You, you said that as it's well. A, like, it's a bright sounding kit. Yeah, it? it's, we, we put a couple of moon gel on the floor, Tom, and really just sort of controlled it. We've mm. got coated heads on it, which is what it comes with, but obviously if you put clear heads on it, it, it would be even brighter again. Yeah, the snare's got a real snap to it. Yeah, snare for quite for quite a deep snare, it has got a crack, hasn't it? Yeah, if you, it, rim shots are cool. Actual rim hits, probably lacking with the the snare, but I think that's more the hoops, though, isn't it? Because we yeah, you can change them out. Yeah, because we mm. did a uh, some diecast cross stick this morning, and they were a lot stronger than that. Where this is triple yeah. flange, isn't it? So comparing snares that way, but yeah, it's just everything's. It's not like super fancy, it's just designed for purpose. So you've got memory locks on the bass drums, whereas really cool memory locks on heavy. the floor tom. Yeah, they're, they're pretty heavy. They're heavy memory locks and heavy feet. So it's just sturdy and well built. Mm. And yeah, it's quite nice to have something that's uh, made in the UK here. So if it's not made by Bill Murray. Let's not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was, uh, let's just leave it. Yeah, yeah roll, roll with that. that. Yeah. So check out the links below. Check out Josh playing. We didn't, uh, didn't bash the hell out of it because it's limited edition. But this is number eight, and this is the only one we're going to get. So check out the links below, and we'll see you next time. Hey guys, thanks for watching the Anderton's Drum Channel. Hope you enjoyed it. But if you're a guitar player or a bass player, you play keyboards or you're into music technology, we've got other YouTube channels that you might be interested in and I'll put links to those in the description below. Anyway, if you want to find out more about the products we showed in this video, please click up here. If you'd like to watch another video from the Drum Channel, please click over here. If you'd like to buy a t-shirt like this one or in lots of other colors, click down here. And finally, if you'd like to subscribe to the Anderton's Drum Channel, please click down here. Anyway, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.